today I got to go on an adventure to the junkyard to go get a tire. It turns out pulling a tire or a wheel, whatever, off of a rim that is elevated off the ground is a little bit tricky because it wants to spin free while you're trying to break the bolts loose. But you can just stick a wrench in through one of these holes, it'll catch on the brakes, and then you can break them free. And it's not a problem. So yeah, I got to rescue my mom and replace her rim because she hit a pothole and it like bent the rim and yeah, not fun stuff. That was what happened in my life today. The little bit of excitement and satisfaction for getting to do a job well done. And I got to go collect some random metal scrap from the junkyard that I can maybe play with for welding. So we'll see if that ends up being a good thing or if it just wastes space in my house. One of the two. Everyone wants to talk to me. Look, we are so popular. I don't want to talk to any of you. Into the world. We are trying to get a nightmare win. That is the goal. That is the plan. No, don't. I don't want to talk to you. Okay, cool. Cool. Don't care, tentacle girl. Got it. No, don't go near... Thank you. Yeah, that's fair. Just let me leave. I just want to play the video game. No? Okay. They hate me. Stop. If you want to see complete randomness from my latest Cube Chaos videos... I tried recording them in a vertical format, which does not work at all, but it was kind of fun. It was an experiment, an unsuccessful experiment. So the main thing we have learned is that relics are amazing because we have so much limited space and we can't accrue enough money for it to really be super valuable. The main thing that does not get nerfed at all from playing at without any of the meta progress unlocked is relics. Everything else kind of gets nerfed. Crap. This is significant because my mana is so low. Defense is nice, but I think we need this. Even though it doesn't help me right now, it'll help in the future. Right. You're going to zoom towards me, and you're going to explode. Tall Spider is super jumpy. Super jumpy. I got to hang out with my mom's dog, too. A Corgi. Corgis are kind of fun. They're just, like, super happy. Okay, taking stupid damage. Super happy, smiley-looking dogs. I almost just got baited into getting blown up. This one is good. This one is amazing. Not right now so much, but later on, it's really good. Right now it's decent. Is it time for an anvil? It could be. Ah, it's weird. I'm gonna say no, but maybe. I'd like a few more spells. Okay, that thing just cornered me so aggressively. I thought that they just hopped. It came charging at me. Not cool. We'll get healed back up. We'll do it. Not even a concern. Relics. Nope, you're too close. Get away from me. Those things are actually chill, so I don't even know why I'm shooting it. Why would I shoot a chill? Like, you're not even really an enemy. You're kind of an enemy, but only because the game says that you're my enemy. Like, we could be friends. Except that I can't complete the level without killing you. But that little detail aside, we could be friends. Like, look at how chill they are. They're peaceful. They do drop money. Sometimes. Rarely. 
Okay, if you hit them with all three projectiles, they really zoom at you. More mana or piercing? More mana or piercing? More mana. That mana could make a difference. More relics. Max mana is really helpful. But with Volley, I might not need it. It depends if I can get the wand slots. Why did I run that direction? My HP is not going up so far. A red one. That one just jumped into the void. No! Don't do it, spider! That one, the legs were still grabbing on, but the head fell in the void. This one? D damage for money. Okay, so now... Wait, why haven't I already done this? Because I don't actually need the mana regen yet. Okay. Boss fight. Okay, wait. Somebody left me a comment. Something useful to know about this. Something about how it bounces, or boings, or something. There was a good piece of info that I wanted to register in my brain, but then I forgot it. Oh, something if you crit it, it will bounce more aggressively or something. I need to pay attention to that. Not right now, but when I have crits. Like, maybe you can activate it quicker with crits or something. There was good info that I want to pay attention to in the future. I need to remember that. We only get the one wand. This, neither of these are any good. Neither is any good. Is it better than this? Maybe. Final damage gets multiplied. Um, 0 0.2, 0 0.8. It's so much slower. It's so much slower. And what does this one do? If I do above 45 damage, I don't do above 45 damage. All right, max HP. I shoot so slow. It's painful. It's super painful. I regret everything. But if I land all three shots, I do 39 damage. Why did I run into that thing? I don't know. Because that's the thing that I choose to do in the video game. There's going to be a king, yep, king slime. Which we have to kill quickly. Because it will spawn more big slimes. Which will spawn more little slimes. Okay, cool. Which will start to overwhelm me. Right, you do area bounces. I still have not gotten healed up. Kind of a bad sign. Okay, kill that. I thought I saw like something invisible over here, but it wasn't, it was the smoke cloud. Okay. Just you wait. We're about to do broken things soonish. Maybe. Do I have a key? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Why would the game give me a key? That would be cheaty. To get keys, you have to unlock the meta upgrades. Okay, I can't hit that thing. We got this. We super got this. Easy game. Those shots bounce. Butterflies. Not the brain and the butterflies. Okay, I was feeling trapped. Because I was a little bit trapped. Okay, now we're good. Just hide behind the two shots. Break the butterflies. Okay, there's a key in this barrel. Second volley. Floating wisp is kind of weird. It really wants to be upgraded. Upon hitting enemies, wisps... Near nearby wisps are attracted. Okay, it's cheaper at least. It is cheaper. And can I ever do 45 damage? 40 damage, we're getting close. We are getting close. Still no key, open up. Okay, onwards. 
Watch out, because when I walk to the edges, I will spawn more spiders. Oh, snakes are a pain. Snakes on a plane. Nope. 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 Okay, I can crit for 80 now somehow. Oh, with the wisps. They do big damage because they do 40 base, 80 crit. 40 base, 80 crit. 40 base, 80 crit. Okay, cool. The wisps do some damage. They're going to be good against bosses. Until I find something better. A little bit of money. We did get a diamond in there. Just shoot it. Do I ever go to a shop? Nope. Pickaxe. And we need spells. Then I could go to an anvil. I'm getting some purple spawned. Okay, now hit it. Nope. The purples being spawned didn't really help, but it could have. This one drops a head when it dies. And the head shoots little projectiles at me. And it's kind of tanky. One of them, I think, fell into the void. That helps. Okay, feeling a little bit trapped. Only a little bit. What is that potion? That potion randomly upgrades one relic. Ooh. Both of my relics are good. A third. Oh, no. I thought that was Volley. Lame. Bam. Level three. Merlin's hat. Cool. Anything else? That's it? Lots of butterflies. That's a little bit scary. I can hide behind trees if I need to. I shouldn't need to. Spider friend. Those projectiles. I was getting stuck on a bush. So you are kind of a pain, arcane thing. I'm just gonna let my spider friend handle these. Okay, but maybe not. I lied. Spider friend, good job. Oh no! Spider friend, get back into the world. Damage or defense? So right now, 20% damage. This would probably be about 20% damage. This is defense. Am I trying to get a devil deal? Not really. I think I'm trying to go max HP. In which case, Rageful Eye can be decent. 17.5. Max HP. Let's go. Spider friend. You can do this, spider friend. Spider friend is just good. Not against the elites or the bosses, but... For little rooms, it's really good. More max HP? Yes, we will. We're up to 100. It's not that much, but it's a little bit. Spider friend, you take care of those. Because I'm kind of... Oh no, don't hit the fire like that. I'm kind of chill with those stone things, so I don't really want to start fights with them. I can let my spider friend do my dirty work. No, you're going to explode and kill the spider friend, maybe. Nope. Good job, friend. Boss time. Anything I can do? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. No defense. It's okay. I don't need the devil deal. 85 HP. There's a chance the spider just destroys this. And the purple shot should do a lot. But this enemy is kind of a pain. Purple shots do a lot. Purple shots do a lot. Okay. Kill it. Good job. So we did get the devil deal. This needs to be an amazing wand. You can do it, wand. 
simultaneous firing three, good amount of speed, while holding this wand, I zoom. I think I have to take this one. It's just better in like every way, except for the simultaneous firing, which is kind of good, but with Fuse, we can do it anyways. They're both good wands though. This is so good, that cooldown. So right now, what does this do? That doesn't work. It would work with this, wouldn't it? What is the cost? 1.3, 3.8. I take this off. 1.7, okay. It's gonna add more scatter. But look at how good it is. And we could put this on here. Spider friend is still alive. Oh no, decision time. I think I'm just gonna take this one. Cause keys are a problem. We have not seen a key yet. This one's kind of good. It's very defensive. It could get me killed. This could also get me killed. This also hurts my ability to get rageful eye up. But my damage just went a lot higher. I need some kind of tracking. I need better projectiles. And really, I need a volley plus instead of two volleys. All right, on to act two. Feeling good. Spider friend does get re-rolled, probably. Sorry to say it. I cannot just keep things just for fun. Those purple shots could pull me into the saw blade. They did just pull me in. Not to the saw blade, but they started to pull me in. Snakes. Snakes are a pain. Lado is here, trying to get attention. Lado's unhappy that I was off playing with another dog. He doesn't get super jealous of smelling me, smelling another dog on me, but he knows the corgi that I was hanging out with, my mom's corgi. So he recognizes that smell and it gets him like all hyped up and excited. Okay, anvil time. We're like right where the anvil's good. Okay, let's go do it. And we got the side room, which isn't the best. I could just use the side room. No, I don't have enough spells to give one up. Can't do it, ah, but it would be kind of good. Spider friend, you're probably going away. Poison's decent, but not amazing. Area up, could be good. This one doesn't do much, but it does more than nothing. Rock and ball. Huh. That one's kind of interesting. Ghost snake is amazing, shadow serpent. Okay. Area up becomes damage up. Poison is a little bit better now. Let's see what this looks like. We already know it's gonna look good, but it needs tracking of some kind. To get tracking, I really need a rare spell. Still. Tentacle. I like tentacle way too much. Okay, magic bullet. Crap, split. Split is kind of cool. That's a split plus. Crap. Does split plus even work with the tentacles? Oh, it does, but it works with their little hits. And they're so inaccurate. Huh. I'm gonna say no to this. Oh, that's kind of good. Hover. We need something amazing, not kind of good. Penetration. Arcane explosions. Decent. Lasers, decent. But I don't want an upgraded laser. Split plus is back. All right, split plus for now. This ghost fire seems very questionable. I should look for a better projectile. 
But for right now, I could go re-roll the split. The split is making these cost so much mana, and it doesn't even do that much. The problem is, whatever it rolls into might be completely worthless. Or it might be a pop, which is kind of cool. Is it kind of cool? Am I just going summons? 20, they're so expensive. Oh no, not poison. Wait, no, they do leave. Poison pops are kind of a pain. And their accuracy is terrible. What are you even aiming at? Nobody knows. Ghost snake doesn't really work yet. Kind of works. Okay, I'm gonna take off the poison. We do have double volley, so I could do this, and that makes them all cheaper. Okay, we'll do that. So once I get five of these, it kind of doesn't help to re-roll them anymore, but whatever. They're upgraded too. Look, I put out damage, it's just not accurate damage. I get to open stuff for free, it's so good. Keys saved, one. Except I did have a key this time. How did I get a key? Don't know. One of the pops had died. Upon entering a room, the first slot of spells in the inventory will be reforged. Yep. That's the one. That makes spell books a little bit better. Crap. Those things can pull me in, but they don't do it for ghost snakes. They cannot pull me in. Okay, watch out for the explosives. We're doing it. Hopefully the spider friend stays alive for a very long time. Tentacles are putting in work. The pops are putting in tons of work. This is such a good one. Automatic navigate. That is important. That is important. Cool. Resonance rune doesn't do anything. It's not a rare though. Okay. Still doesn't do anything. I think it's relics. Those ghost snakes having a little bit of tracking makes them so much better. Same with these. The pops are a little bit questionable, but they're decent until I can re-roll them. And now their shots are more accurate. Way more accurate. Look at how good their shots are. Look at how good they are. This one? Yep. More max HP is good, because I only have 62. Oh no. Stupid decision time? The best decisions. Let's see what the game is going to offer me. Reduce movement speed. Cool. Decrease HP by 4. That one's not that bad. Curse that changes over time. That one's rough. Locked objects require 2. That one's amazing. Unable to cast. That one's brutal. This one's a little bit rough, but we can get rid of it later. I might only take five. So it's between unable to cast is rough or curse that changes over time. Let's see what this gives. Ooh, Merlin's beard and potion belt are both really good. Penetrates okay. The book. The book could be helpful. Mana. We could do that before. Oh no, I already took the one that damages me. But I did take Potion Belt, too. Healing Belt. Okay, so now. Curse that changes over time? Let's do it. Remove all curses. Would I pay 57 coins to get rid of all my curses? No. No, I would not. They're not even that bad. Okay, but Ghost Snake is good. Especially with that tracking. I could get rid of the damage. I just got Merlin's beard, so we can get extra summons, which goes crazy. So 
So if we get rid of the damage... I could do the books casting snakes. Maybe that makes sense? So we can have six books. God, and so many pops. Okay, this feels decent. Let's go get some max HP, especially since I take damage. Okay, get off of me. I don't have that much HP to spend. That was scary. How many books do we have? Six. Read a book. Okay, now I feel strong. Good enough. I could start getting rid of curses. Huh. Do I get rid of two curses? I want to get rid of the one that changes over time. Bam. Did not get rid of it. This is the only one I care about. Bam. Did not get rid of it. Okay. Now if I get the potion that gives me five, I can't even drink it. Ghost snakes are so good. Okay, one more book. We have all the books down. And I have a bunch of tentacles, and I have a bunch of pops, and that's a good potion. And I no longer take damage when I drink a potion. Pretty sure. Okay, I just want to hit this thing. This one. Deduct 40% of current HP. Oh, to gain a current or a corresponding amount of shields. Lame. I think I gained max mana. We have a lot of max mana. That's helpful. Okay, so what if this thing counters summons? Then I'm in trouble. Wait, I'm supposed to be re-rolling something. Reroll this. Did I really miss a reroll? Did I miss more than one? I missed at least one. This is a pretty easy enemy. By which I mean, I don't even think I have to do anything. Ooh, upgraded spell. It's kind of weird that they don't give you the choice of three after the elite fight. So this one is a pretty good upgrade. This one is a rare, so that's high priority, except that one's pretty good to put on books. That one's really good if I get a fuse. I need a third one of these. Okay, more spells, more money. Do I think I'm gonna fill up on spells? Because I can re-roll. I think I want to get filled up quickly and then go to an anvil. The books will do craziness. Oh, one comment I got was that when you summon a new book, they start with full mana, but I don't think that's true at all. I think that is one of the comments that is just incorrect, which is fair. I'm incorrect about lots of things, but it looks like they take a while to fill up their mana when you first... Well, these ones look full. No, maybe they just instantly summon their ghost snakes. I'll have to pay attention. I could see that one going either way. Okay, damage plus is pretty good. How do I fit it? How do I fit a damage plus? I don't. Like, I could do it in place of a ghost snake, but the ghost snake lowers the price of everything, which is pretty useful because the books get to summon quicker if things are cheaper. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay, reroll this one, even though it's kind of good. What am I looking for? Mouse tracking, probably. Oh, but I need a volley. I do need a volley. Let's look for volley. Oh, but rebound. Rebound's kind of lame. Okay. Relics. No! 
Okay. Worst enemy. Worst enemy. Do not like. Okay. We're fine. That was super scary. Okay, good. I mean, these things are big, but... They do summon the snakes right away when they spawn, it looks like. So they do start with full mana, I think. Okay. I take back what I said about that comment. It looks like they were correct. So, crit chance. 0%. 0%. 0%. 0%. Do I think I'm going to get crit chance? Because if I do, I think this one's amazing. And I don't think either of these are that good late game. This one's okay. This one might be good enough. Okay. Okay. Max HP or spells. Fuse is amazing. Okay, Fuse is amazing. With tracking. Where do I put this? Just right here. Why do I use pops? Because pops are kind of good. Oh. I think that's fine. So everything's price should have got reduced. Wait, can I do this off a single volley now? 8.5. 8.5. I think I can. Okay. That means that we can do damage plus. Plus, I have a book. So I have a fuse and a book. Yeah. Yeah. All right. We're still looking for the volley. That fuse was a good roll. Do I look for volley or for tracking? Volley. Okay. Spell book. Max HP. Fuse is kind of good, too, with the uh, summons, because it's nice to get the summons, like, all over the place. Instead of just having the summons next to me. Open this? Sure. Anvil time. I think it's anvil time. Is it? Yeah. We got three ghost snakes. Good stuff. It's not my favorite upgrade, but it does a lot more damage. It's good. Okay, I'm creating way too much chaos. But look at that DPS. Look at it. So much DPS. All right, so we have chaos going on over there. What are we looking for? Volley. Right, this one, 92 money. Volley, volley. What about that one? No. Is there anything else I could be re-rolling? uses another good hit. Um, Troll's Blood. Troll's Blood on a heavy summon build. Weird. Are the books casting both of these? It definitely looks like they are. Very weird. Oh, I can't cast for the first few seconds upon entering. That random curse. Five seconds. One of the most brutal curses in the video game. Okay, don't do this, butterflies. Damage is good. We get to go to the side room. I do have lightning dash, and I have... Automatic navigate doesn't really help with lightning dash. Mouse tracking would help. Just 
break this. Break it. Put the book back down. Oh no. Okay, this one's easy. This one is easy. It's on the right. Disruption Ray Plus. On the right. Nice and slow. Full concentrate in the middle. I have no idea then. Okay, thank you for the curses. Max mana, items available in shops. Joke's on you, now I have five curses, which makes potions even easier to use. I'm breaking these with fuses right now. Cool. Cool. Disruption Ray Plus could roll into something amazing. Relic? Yeah, Relic. I'm kind of worried about the next boss. Because it does a decent job clearing summons. But my damage is decent too, so I might just kill it quickly. Alright, let's try to get some crits. Double what's on the ground. Alright. Book time. No, okay, these aren't, these are the ones that reflect. Crap. Okay, still summon more, even though these ones hard counter. Oh no, if it's the boss, wait for the elite. If it's the elite that steals projectiles, I'm in trouble. What do I do if that's the case? If that's the case. Oh no, this one is good. Oh no. That one's really good. It can't steal tentacles. How sure am I about that? Not very. Not very sure. Tentacles are pretty good. What if we just took the book out? Why would I take the book out? Because I can. What do I want to reroll? This one. Even though Meteor is good, it's not what I'm trying to do. So right now, take this off. Fuse. I just want to break the boxes. There we go. No, this takes away shields, do it. Level three. There's another potion. Resets one chosen relic. Cloud Piercer or... I think it's this one. The rest are all pretty good. Yeah, they are. Did I just take damage from drinking that? I think I did. Decent. Very decent. So we're down to three shields. Changes over time. I could have... No, I couldn't really wait to drink that. Okay, so right now... I'm not doing books, which seems questionable. Yeah, we need to keep doing books. Keep doing books. God, I need more capacity. Multi-shot would be so good right now. Um, I don't see a way to get it into the build yet. 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 Go get relics. Okay, so HP. Not the greatest. Get these brains away from me. I'm trapped. I don't like not doing my own damage sometimes. Because I feel very out of control. Like, I'm dependent on what my summons do. More potions. B 
because I have a level three healing belt. So potions are kind of amazing. Just break these. I wish I took Ember Heart, kind of. What did I have it in place of? I don't remember. Oh, it was up against this one, I think. Rageful Eye is pretty good right now. 34% increased damage. Just break these. Invincibility for eight seconds. I mean, I have to go drink that. But first, break that. Okay. Reforge. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Some of these are pretty good. I have a second book. I don't know if I care about the second book much. What about this? The pop, ah, with the summon limit, the pop is better than usual. I don't know what I'm looking for. Black hole, interesting. I got rid of my second tentacle. So what do I do if it's the one that captures my shots? If it's the one that captures my shots, I cannot use black hole. I can't use pops really. All I can use is hand of Cthulhu. Do I just prepare for that? I could. Wait, it could be books that shoot hand of Cthulhu. That could be a thing, but now they cost more. Snake is good. This one can go. Orbit gives spell duration. Don't care too much. That's kind of wild. 30.4. 22.8. So that doesn't lower the price. If I put another projectile down, it would lower the price. The problem is, if it's the enemy that messes with me, that steals projectiles. I could put Frost onto here right now. It's just this one fight that I'm concerned with. Um... go see what it is the ca oh wait why did I think that this was the fight that it is not I should have known that this is the cage okay I would like to change my spells then would I I think I would okay so I would like that. Is this good? I don't know. No, I just caused it to get rid of all those tentacles. They do create ghost snakes, which is good. The ghost snakes aren't very quick because I don't have orbit on it. We're still doing this, but it's going to do the spin move, probably. Is it going to do spin move? Yeah, it is. Which direction? I'm so fast if I'm not casting. It's dead. It's super dead. Easy game. Okay. Not my best by not having that set up correct. What do you got for me? Mana cost reduced and so many spots. Mana cost reduced. Good cooldowns. Crazy cooldowns. I think it's this one, but it's hard to say. Those cooldowns give up one slot, but also the 80% cost. It's really hard to say. I th it also comes with the split. I'm gonna say it's this one, but it's tough. That only got me two extra spots. Still, two extra spots. Okay, fuse. 
So right now, 13.7. If I put you into the world, 10.3. If I put you into the world, 7.7. I could have a book that casts black holes. Does it also cast tentacles? Wait, does the book cast everything? These are the two that I would like the book to cast most, I think. Although, I could just cast them myself. This one's decent, but not that good. I think I skip on this room. Flying. I don't value flying that much. Sometimes it could be good. All right, for now, that is going to do it for this episode. We will continue on tomorrow. Are we up to 3,000? We are three subscribers away from 3,000. Now is your chance to get in on the ground floor and be one of the first 3,000 subscribers. All right, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching.